What up? It's your boy, Dick Incredible Man, and yes, I am back at it again, and this is My Hair Academia Season 5, Episode 9, and after last week's episode, man, oh my gosh, pure greatness, man, because we see that the fights went hardcore. Everybody put in work last week, man, Class 1A, Class 1B, everybody brought it brought it all and laid it all on the table, and the fights were legit, man. I gotta give it a round of applause because it was just that freaking fantastic, and it ended in a draw, so... Neither side really won. That that match was a draw. But now this week, we're dealing with Bakugo. And we all know that, you know, Bakugo don't do loss. So let's dive into this episode to see what's popping off, man. I don't think I do it good. No, I think I do it great. They would do it if they could. They can't do it, so they hate. Everybody want to look, but nobody want to play. Stealing eyes. I'm not saying that he can't lose, but I'm just saying we know that, you know, it's, it's Bakugo, man. So it's tied it's tied all up now, man. Oh, well, so he has something planned. Let's get it, man. Oh, we're just diving straight into it. I'm not mad at it. Let's get it, man. Yeah, those are some bad, some bad matches because Jiro can hear and Saro can shoot from wherever you want to go. Like his maneuverability is very high. The early bird. But it's Bakugo, man. I just don't see Bakugo losing. I mean, we know how he has a tendency to just... And they decided to take everything head on too, though. This man. <laughs> He's not wrong. Right. That's what I said, though. I, didn't I say that? Class 1B treated this like a real fight. Uh. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. They treated this more realistic than Class 1A did. Class 1A treated this like a training system. This ain't a training system. This is a fight. I don't know, man. Like, you know, this foreboding music, man. It's kind of getting to me. My heart's racing a little bit. Ears. <laughs> hey, ears. <laughs> No, he no, we don't need to wait. Create an opening. Right. That's what I'm that's what I'm saying, man. Yeah, see Baka go thought this through. Bakugo really thought this through, man. Yvonne, Yvonne was thinking, man. Sh sh my heart's beating on fast, man. Oh, she used the slugs. Like, are those slugs? What are those? 
to make the sounds. Oh, they use that to mess up Jiro. Oh, her body breaks apart. L Lizard tail splitter. Nice. Oh, and she had a bird's eye view. I told you they can't, they can't, they can't prepare, man. Wow, I told you class class one V came prepared, man. They came prepared, man, and they all using their quirks to their best ability and to their fullest ability. But don't underestimate Bakugo, I'm telling you. I told you, man, they can't underestimate Bakugo. Bakugo ain't playing, he doing it all by himself. He's so low in him. He's so low in him. Your boy is solo in him. Your boy is solo in him. Wow, your boy changed. Your boy changed. Your boy James, man. Oh my gosh. Oh, this man said he going for a complete victory, baby. <laughs> right, your boy changed, man. But that's a bad plan, especially for someone like Bakugo and Jiro. Because she's honed her quirk. I mean, overall, thinking about it, it's a good plan. But against someone like Bakugo, I don't think that's a great plan. See, like they honed their quirks. So look at that animation. Look at your boy move.
Nice. Nice. But I don't see this working. It's... It, Oh, I don't know, man. Okay, sugar rush. <laughs> I'm telling you, man, Bakugo is like the wrong opponent for you guys to have this kind of plan with. He's one of those people you can't plan against. Son, they came prepared. Okay, class one, they came prepared this time. These fights are going hell, man. Oh my gosh, these fights are going crazy. Look at your boy. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Wow. Yeah, man, they just they just came unprepared, man. Like they tried, but Bakugo is on another level. I'm sorry. Ace catapult! Oh my gosh! Okay, maybe I'm doing too much, but oh my gosh. You gotta admit, this this is crazy. This man is soloing these people. They're backing him up as support, but Bakugo is doing all the work. Oh, Zero tape some of her body parts now. Wow. Wow, he taped the grenade to her body for it. Oh, wow. Wow. Your boy just soloed the whole freaking team. Your boy just soloed the whole freaking team. Like, they helped. Don't get me wrong. I'm not knocking Jiro and everybody else because they assisted. But because they helped Bakugo and Bakugo helped them. But oh, my God. <laughs> and they ain't even lose nobody, man. This man said what he was going to do, done it, completed it, and, and that is it. Oh, my gosh. I kind of felt sorry for... uh. 1B on that one, man. <laughs> but like I said, them deciding to retreat was the wrong strategy against Bakugo. It was a good plan, but it was just the wrong... You guys had the wrong one, man.
<laughs> Catcher! <laughs> Is it Deku? Oh, All Might. <laughs> Wait, I, if you move, you... Nice, man. That was a match, yo. Dude, that was a match. I told you he was not the one, though. We all knew that Bakugo was not the one. <laughs> now we got Deku and uh, Shinso match. <laughs> this man oh my gosh Mono is crazy yeah it'll just overall be a tie if they win oh this man oh this man demented <laughs> yeah, so there's more people, but <laughs> oh, the shoot style. Yeah, yeah. Depends on how you guys come come at it. I want to know how they're going to handle it, though. Well, they're not wrong. They have to stop Midoriya first. So they're going to send Shinso straight after Midoriya. Yeah, because you, you're dealing with someone else. Now, now, Midori, on the other hand, your boy is analytical, man. Like, he has notes on notes on notes on notes. <laughs> we're at a disadvantage <laughs> we're at a disadvantage <laughs> yeah they have to attack first because of their quirks yeah because they're going to come at the Midori anyway I'm I'm good now. Ooh. 
What you got, Midoriya? Oh, yeah, your boy's hype, man. Your boy's hype. How much time we got left? Uh, we're not going to get too much. We're, we're probably going to start. Son, I got to say, I, I am all kinds of excited right now, though. Let's go, man. Oh, yeah. We're not going to get anything. We're not going to get anything. It's going to go off. Let's go. Okay, man. Oh, boy. Dude. I don't know, man. That episode was legit, man. Um, that was My Hair Academia Season 5, Episode 9. Um, last week's episode was crazy. This week's episode went hardcore, man. We see that Bakugo soloed Class 1B. And I don't mean to discourage Class 1B, man, because they, they done what they could. But it wasn't quite enough because their plan was to attack them and then, and then you know, kind of use, uh, oh, crap, crap, I can't think of her name. Oh, girl's quirk, you know, kind of throw Jiro off and then just attack him singularly one by one. And then once that really wasn't working, they decided to retreat. Now, the only thing with that, it was a good possibility and it was a good thought, but they had the wrong person in this battle because Bakugo was one of those people that that was his plan from the jump anyway was to, to attack them head on but he's one of those people that you know if you don't deal with him he's going to become a problem later especially in a fight so their best possible choice was like how they were doing to to directly go after him and confront him and they just would have had a full-fledged fight because that's what Bakugo wanted but once they came in contact and they started doing all that, they kind of backed off, and that's when they lost the match, in my opinion. Other than that, I think they would have had at least stood a chance, but their percentage drastically dropped once they decided to back off and kind of regroup because that made Bakugo chase them even more, and it separated them from each other because they didn't have a chance to regroup, so Bakugo went after them individually, and sure, he changed, you know, in other people's eyes and everything, and, you know, he's not solely about himself anymore. He's saving people at the same time. And that shine and showcased in this match. But that's not what really just won him the match. You know what I'm saying? Like, those two instances where they came and said, where um, they saved Bakugo and Bakugo got saved, that, that highlighted the match. But that's not what really helped the match. What helped the match was because Bakugo continuously went after them and they they were a cohesive unit, if you will. And th this match was crazy, man. This episode was legit. You guys know I was screaming the entire time. I was in love with it. But now I'm ready for next week's episode already because we see Deku versus Shin Shinso. And I'm just I'm just all there for it, man. This is your boy, Incredible. Don't forget to smash the like button so you can't smash any more. Comment down below and I'll be sure to respond to each and every one of them and subscribe, but only if you really want to, man. And remember, the anime matters, anime is greatness, and anime is life, man. Peace out. Okay.